Rescue mission day 38. Now secure some people. CEO of Telecom Company, Alpin, home planet Kodahan. His boundless ambition drove him to expand his telecommunication business into areas like space travel, food, and entertainment. President of Tolbol Real Estate, Chowder, home planet Kodahan. He followed his whims in real estate for 27 years. Now he travels the galaxy, expecting his next big idea to pop up out, oh, out of nowhere. Thank you again for saving us. I don't know what... I don't think we'd be alive if not for you. No? York, that reminds me. We saw you get sucked up into that onion, but you seem completely normal. Pass. Are there any sort of abnormal... abnormal ugh, abnormalities that we're missing? Any leaves growing in you at all? Um, not that I've noticed. So strange. I can't help but wonder why you didn't turn into a leafling. The juice. Probably not the spacesuit. Oh yeah. I bet it's because of all that glowing juice we drank. Of course. You were ingesting nearly pure glow sap, so the leaves must have been broken down before you could sprout. It's just a theory, but an intri- <laughs> Oh. Cough is killing me. But an interesting one at that. I don't suppose you'd let me conduct an experiment, experiment, examination <laughs> later. Experimentation, that's probably not right. If Yoni's theory is correct, then Nelly may not have been turned into a leafling either. You'll still rescue her though, right? Yes, please, we need your help. Calm down now. Of course we intend to rescue her. That's what we do. Nelly's waiting for us deep in the forest. Let's hurry up and find her. We can't let her and Ochi down. Copy that. It's a new area to go to, but I kind of want to do some other things first. Especially now that we have five onions in one. We can reproduce rock pigment. Oh, it's you again. This is fascinating. I was able to confirm that the onion has fused. Please, keep collecting different colors of onions. I've got a lot more research to do. Fuse six onions. Well, I'll try to. Hey, the nom name's Don Bergman. I'm just here fighting the good fight on behalf of, my little, of the little guys. Oh, we've already met, haven't we? Sorry about that. No, 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 it's a good, good, good conversation. Conversation good. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm so grateful to you for rescuing my employer. This couldn't possibly be enough. You've done so very much for us, but please take this. 15 materials, thank you. Thank you very much. I'd like to sincerely thank you once again for all your help for coming to our aid, Jeremy and Ochi. My employer doesn't always consider the risk to himself. His first priority is making enough money to pay his employers. Employees. That one. <laughs> He's always putting us first. I honestly don't know what the company would do without him. Number one. My employer is a natu natural salesperson. Through and through. He talks about the scorching desert on Sigare. Calling it a place that's blessed with abundant natural light. He's described that the steep rocky mountains on Flukare, Uri as the best place for a home with sunny views in every room. The lush jungle on Uchi is relaxing a relaxing environment where you're surrounded by the beauty of nature. That's how he convinces potential clients to come out and look at these properties, those properties. It doesn't always result in a sale, but it's worth a try, I suppose. It's not what you say, but how you say it, right? That's actually really interesting information about the other planets in this universe. So oh man, for a humble real estate agent, I, sh I sure did cause you quite the hustle, didn't I? The name's Chowder, by the way. 
Don't suppose you've heard of Tolbo Real Estate? You haven't, huh? Guess I need to work on my marketing. Oh. Now nah, I feel bad for him. Well, well. If it isn't my little rescue pal. The name's Alpin. Founder and CEO of the company called E-Leader. But seriously, you're a real hero. I've got nothing but gratitude. Is that all the new stuff at the moment? There's a lot of <laughs> castaways. I do like that. You're making some real good progress. Curing folks. You know what that means? Reward time. 30 materials for 15 le leaflings. I like your pace, give it up. Cure all leaflings. <laughs> That's gonna be a little bit probably. Or maybe not, I don't know. Uh, but anyway, let's upgrade what we can. I think there's only um, one upgrade left at the moment, so. Tough stuff plus plus. And there hasn't been any new gear for a while, so we might not. Never mind, there's another one here. Air armor plus plus. But we might not be able to get more gear, possibly. Anyway, let's do a nighttime mission, because I want to do that. Get all the gear from the lab complete. Okay, I was right. I was worried I might get tired of creating new gear, but seeing you in action continues to inspire me. And that's saying something. Coming from me, I usually reserve my compliments for the feats of empirical thought itself. There we go. Our discussion just gave me a brilliant idea. Collect some more raw material, and I'd be happy to turn it into a reality. What do you mean? Are <laughs> yeah, you interested in an item? Also, plucking whistle. Oh, by whistling the Pikmin, and we can have them get out of the ground themselves. That's really good, but we need a lot of materials for that. But yeah, really good. Let's do another night mission. Going to the abandoned throne. Four star difficulty. It's gonna be a buzz with danger. Apparently. Build structures during the day to make night expeditions easier. It's interesting that it didn't give us the option of the other place to land. Since there are three places to land here, so... Okay, let's go. And go fast, hopefully. Is there only one knoll? Yes, there is. Because off the top of the screen says there's a thing. You know what I mean? Just gonna do a bit of that. We've already got enemies coming towards us. And these ones included. There's also a thing behind me. Oh! Beady long legs is coming from behind me. That's what's going on over there. That's a boss we haven't even seen yet. Although I'm not sure if it's going to be a boss that we will find, but I don't know. Beady long legs is bad. Is that that's all we need to know, really? Need to increase my numbers faster. Although we are also running into some more enemies. Please hurry up, please hurry up, please hurry up, please hurry up, please hurry up. There's stuff behind me. Oh, bugs. Leaf bugs. Got him. Okay. There's a lot of stuff in every direction. We only have 24 Pikmin. Get 15 more. I mean, that's how that works, right? If that... The, the, num the, the number of the piles, how many we get overall. Eventually. I think. Oh, there's a lot. Oh! I hope Ochi's there protecting. Just fine, hopefully. Also, the thing is getting close. Might be good to try and take care of the beady long legs. But also, I need a few more Pikmin, I think. I feel like. Just need to not get crushed by this thing. 
It's too high. Come on. Please. Oh, glue, glow mob. Like that. There we go. I really didn't understand how to do that. Please don't get crushed. Please don't get crushed. Okay, and go. Oh, she's protecting the thing. Oh, that's really not good if, if they just climb up the legs like that. No. Ah. What do I do? Is this the last enemy? It appears to be. But I'm having trouble with it because I don't have enough Pikmin. I don't know if there's any trick knolls to help us out. Nope, call them off. Can I reach that from here? Nope. And it's destroying the thing. Stun! Maybe I can send Ochi somewhere. Can only really hope at this point because I'm gonna lose. Actually, no, we might be alright. Just a little bit more. Got it. Nice. But that's a beady long legs. Why is it not ending? There we go. <laughs> Jeremy Ochi, you did it. Yes, we did. Just one more cure. Okay. 15 enemies. It wasn't that bad. But there was a B long legs, which I could have done better against, probably. Just need more Pikmin, though. Ten more glow seeds. Makes up for the ones I used, I guess. You're really getting the hang of this whole night expedition thing, aren't you? With this glow sap, I can con concoct... Con 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 I feel like I said that wrong. Concoct... 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 Trying to ma make it sound better, but I don't know. A medicine that's sure to kill the leaflings. You did it! Way to go! Now all you've got to do is rescue the leaflings. Eh, no pressure though, Jeremy. Yes, the medicine doesn't expire, so there's no need to rush. <laughs> and there might not be a mission right away, again. Risk mission day 39. That's crazy. Bye, Uchi. Ah, uh, yeah, that's already done. That's strange. We did the first one pretty early as well, which is probably good. Let me see, what's the pup drive at? Eight! We have eight pup drive! Let's use some of that. Mega rush, mega rush. Go for the stun. And increase the damage. Heal is definitely something I still want to get, though. It's also a good thing I upgraded Big Chomp as well. Earlier, because that's just helpful for night missions and stuff. But anyway, I think... Now we can go to the next area. Took a closer look at the SOS signal and saw that the rest of the castaways are located in the area we just uncovered. Nearly the veterinarian should be among them. We're getting close. Which area would you like to explore? We can also go back to Giant's Hearth again as well. And get the other 50% stuff there. One... hundred... A lot of stuff. But it might also be good to find more onion stuff possibly as well. Primordial Thicket.
There's apparently a lot of stuff there that unloads during that now. Because there are so many objects there. This place looks nice. It's interesting comparing this with previous Pikmin games as well. Also, that enemy is familiar. Uh, because in the previous Pikmin games, oh, whoa, what a year. They like to use, like, different seasons for each area. I don't think this one does follows that same, like, idea, I guess, but... Still interesting. Also, hey! It's Louis. Oh, there's Louis. Moss is with him. Hey, that's him. The, that's the scoundrel who stole our juice. And the castaway in Moss's mouth. It's Nelly. Stop right there, Louis. What are you doing with Nelly? Explain yourself. Oh no, Code Red, Code Red. He's a... a absconded? With Nelly, I've never seen that word before. Or heard it. Huh, what was he thinking? Need to follow Louis. Ochi should be able to track his th track the scent. Agreed. You two follow Louis's scent and rescue Nelly. So I guess that will be the last thing we need to do. But anyway, let's try looking around with the servo drone since we're in a new area. It's probably just recommended to do that every time at this point, and even in the past. When we're still looking at new areas. Ah, uh, that looks like that has a treasure or something, maybe. It's landing site here. Also, this place is very kind of autumn-y. So I guess it kind of does have seasons, but we haven't had a full snow area, technically. Hey! That's what I was hoping for. There's a pink onion. Which might be alright to get to, possibly. It's just a dog bowl. It's cool. Also, these flowers have, uh, have, like, been overwhelmed by the, the fungus. There are mushrooms. Another landing site there with some eggs there, which is interesting. Maybe there's something inside them, like an enemy. Was I here fighting? Or something? I heard sound effects, so that's weird. I think that's probably about everything, man. There's a dungeon there. So, how do I get to the pink, then? If it's all the way out this way. Yeah, there's a lot in our path. We have to get through this wall. So, we, our first goal is probably to get to this base over here. Which we don't... I don't even... No, it's... It goes from that way. Which... Connects to here. So, we should be able to... Get there pretty soon, maybe. Recommendation? Ice Pikmin, Pink Pikmin, Wing Pikmin, and White Pikmin. Okay. Let's see what we can do then. If we can get the pink onion, we will be able to propagate winged Pikmin, so that's gonna be good. I still love the way that we can get Pikmin before we even... Um... Get the onions for them. It's also quite interesting that... Like, for Pikmin games, they, there's so many combinations that, of order you can get the onions in. They could have, like, if they wanted to, they could have any order of uh, collecting the items and upgrades, basically. If they wanted to, to mix things up. Oh, sorry, this is going to be bad for me, isn't it? Get off of that. I don't like this. Well, weak point? Question mark? I don't know. Just need to be careful. Oh! Snip, snip. Oh boy. Oh wow. You were destructive. That's kind of helpful though. We can also just do that though, so. I kind of want to beat it up. I'll have to climb up to it, to attack it. I 
No, no, no. Oh, they're getting... Uh-oh. Bad. Get on board. Can I call him out? I think I might have. The enemy's not nice, though. Freeze! Come on! Got it. We don't get its uh, corpse to take back to the onion, but that's okay. Also bad! That would have not been good for that to break during that fight. We okay? We just lost all of our leaves that we just got back. Or flowers, that one. But that's okay. I do suppose. Also, the pink Pikmin, winged Pikmin can't land directly on something, I guess. Sticky mold removed. Those things are just being plain rude. I'll take that though. <laughs> Guess I'll take that back, that's fine. We just need to be careful when moving the base. That it gets back, which should be fine. We haven't made it to where the base is yet. There's still a lot of things in our path. Oh, so that's interesting. it. Nice. It's kind of interesting that they can do that. Okay, here it is. Although I'm sure it's going to be those bug things. Oh, or not! Or not! There's our first one. Be long legs. Oh. I'm sure wing people are good for this. Just need to be careful with them around its legs. Just a few Pikmin at a time and it'll be fine. Let's go ahead and spicy spray. Got it. Nice. It also dropped fruit for us. It doesn't drop his corpse, it just fades away, it disintegrates, so. Oh. Is it back? I think it is. It's all our Pikmin, nice. Just while it's there still powered up. Hey, nice. Let's grab all that then. Almost. Now if we keep going, we might be able to get to the onion. Pretty soon. We need to get rid of some poison, which we find. Also, that was nice. Very nice indeed. Let them take that back. There's a lot of sticky mold around here. Oh, those are attacking those. That's interesting. Also that up there, which we need to throw some white Pikmin across to get to. It's another one of those crab things. How do I get up there? Carefully. Throw some white Pikmin up there and they should be able to handle it on their own. Just need to be careful. There's poison here. Probably want to take out these. Seems good. Nice. Okay. Also probably want to get rid of this sticky mold as well. Okay. Sticky mold removed. And with that, there it is. Well now, that is a downright adorable onion. 
Something about that colour makes it look like it could float away at any second. Okay, let's get it. Nice. Guess we can get a few more things while we're here, possibly. These leaflings, they really are all are all over the place, huh? Come, it is Dendori time. If you say so. Wow, how many castaways have been turned into leaflings? No mind, we need to rescue them all. True stuff. Let's try and get that with our uh, white Pikmin. Although I guess we can jump across probably. Actually, now that I think about it. <laughs> yeah, but that they didn't do anything on their own. Poison mushrooms. All taken care of. Let's make this thing fly away. Well, this water does not look healthy. So muddy, you can't see the bottom. Yes! That's a very nice set of colors. It is indeed. Have a whole collection now. And now we can start propagating pink Pikmin. They've got pink pellets to match as well, just like every other Pikmin. Which I think it, it, it's just so cool to see the different colors of pellets as well. Just a nice little thing. Please. It's not gonna stop. Stop! Stop! <laughs> Throw it when it's the right color, and there'll be always that color, I'm pretty sure. I like the pink pellets for some reason. There's something about the color and the, the shape of it, I don't know. I guess I like all the pellets though, but you get too used to it. New pellets is good pellets. Anyway. There's also another cave over here, another... Another battle. Challenge, that one. The correct one. Look, it's a leafling! Dandori anytime, Dandori anywhere. Dandori over and over and over again. Oh, there he goes. They're dead. It's also... Get that. Find out where that goes. Guess I didn't actually check for where our next goal is to complete our mission. Looking for an orange. There it is. Also, there's these mushrooms again. We haven't seen those since the second level. Okay, interesting. I'm actually tempted to do this right now. 